Hi, I'm Ronick from PR Tech Reviews, and today we will be reviewing the Ravelli 61-inch lightweight aluminum tripod. Let's get started. Okay guys, so here is the awesome looking box. It looks pretty decent from the box itself. Um, so yeah, let's get right to it. So I actually didn't need uh, scissors for this part because there was no tape. There we go, is there anything else? Nope. So it comes out straight into the case. Um, so yep, it has a little carrying bag so you can carry it. Um, so okay, so there's a zipper. Unzip that. And boom, there it is. Anything in here? Oh, what's this? What is this? That's interesting. So it comes with a little keychain thing. I'll find out what that is later. All right, so here we go. All right, plastic cover. You don't need that. Um, instruction manual, I believe. Yep, instruction manual. We might need this later, but not for this review. Alright, so what's this? Cleaning cloth? I have no idea why we would need to clean this, but maybe it got dirty. So yeah, cleaning cloth. Alright, so here is the actual thing itself. Ooh, that's actually... Hmm. When I bought it, it said aluminum, lightweight aluminum tripod. To be honest, um, yeah, it, it is what it is. It's lightweight, it's aluminum. Um, right out of the box, I see some scratches. That's not very impressive. Here, I'll show you real quick. There are these scratches, you can probably see. And a little bit over there. But, that's just minor stuff. So, yeah. Those are the only places where they got scratched. So, it's not bad so far. Okay, so let's stand this thing up. We go like that. So, when it comes in, it's not too tall. Um, but it is supposed to be extendable. So, yeah, let's extend this all the way. So, to extend it, you see these things are here, you just pop them up, and they extend. Like that. So, I'm gonna fully extend it, and I'll be right back. So, here it is fully extended. Um, actually, the legs are fully extended, but you can still make this a little higher. So, it's not the fully 61 inches displayed. Um, so, let's go ahead and fully extend that. So all you have to do is unscrew this, make it a little bit loose, to this way, and then, boom. Just keep going like that, and it will become 61 inches. Whoops. I think that's it, yep. That is the fully extended height. It's not in the camera shot, but, yeah, it's 61 inches, fully extended. And also, when you let go of it, it won't drop down. But if you push on it, it will. Uh, it won't, actually, it won't drop down. So yeah, you actually have to use this uh, little knob thing to get it all the way down. So some interesting features is this little level thing here. Um, as you can see, it is leveled as of right now. Some other parts are this little camera handle. You just hold on to it like that and you can carry it. There is another level over here. Additionally, you have this little quick release thing which you can just go like this like that and this thing comes off so you can attach this to your camera so I just attached the camera to the tripod and it looks amazing it was really easy to put it on with the quick release system and yeah it had a little knob thing to attach the camera itself to the mount which is amazing so real quick we're gonna check out the pan and tilt so this is what it's gonna look like Okay, so I switched to my Galaxy S4, and that's because I only have this handy-dandy camera. Um, so I just wanted to show you some of these cool features. So, as I said, it has a little twist knob that loosens and tightens everything. This one specifically is for the side-to-side. Side-to-side like that. Um, so as you can see, it's drooping down, and that's because this is not tightened. To tighten that, you just screw it in like that. I'm going to adjust the angle and screw it in. Like that, and yeah, it doesn't move. Um, also, this knob over here, you tighten that, then the 90 degree thing doesn't 
happen if you don't want it to happen. And if you loosen it, it will easily switch. Now on to the accessories. So first you have this little keychain thing. Uh, it serves as a light. It serves as a flashlight and a keyring. So you just turn it on by pulling it back. And it's decent. It's not too bright. But, yeah, it's a, it's a cool thing that it comes with it. And then finally, you had the cleaning cloth. Uh, the cleaning cloth is pretty... It's interesting. It's not like your original uh, cleaning cloth you would get for cleaning your glasses. It's actually more rubbery and stretchy than any cleaning cloth I've used for my glasses. So, this is a different material, but it's similar to any cleaning cloth for glasses. So all in all, this tripod is actually pretty amazing. It's $21.99 off of Amazon, and for me it came for free shipping um, because I had Amazon Prime. Now, I'd like to say that this tripod, even though it says it's made of aluminum, it feels like it's, it's hollow. It actually is hollow. Uh, if you like flick at it, you can hear that it's hollow, and if you feel the very bottom part, which is very skinny, and it feels like if you kick it or hit it with a bat, it's going to break, and it probably would. However, you have to remember that this is only $21.99, and you get what you pay for. I pay $21.99, I get $21.99 worth of tripod. And, honestly, it's not bad. It gets the job done, it holds up your camera wherever you want it, you can adjust it on the pads on the bottom, hold it down on carpet, or even tile. Again, this tripod is $21.99 off of Amazon, so I will leave a link to it in the description so you can get check it out. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and favorite it. That's new. So yeah, I'm Ronick from PR Tech Reviews, and I will see you in my next video. Hey guys, I'm Ronick from PR Tech Reviews, and today I will be teaching you guys how to take a long exposure picture. Yeah, let's try that. Okay guys, I am actually very satisfied with the end result of this. Uh, I'm gonna move to another location and try to get some cool pictures now. I will not be recording these, but I will have the full resolution pictures towards the end of the video 